Okay guys, look at that nice morning. We're gonna do some deep water jigging. Fishing like 30 to 100 feet of water. We're up in the Finger Lakes region of New York. Uh, gonna target a bunch of different fish. I've got Meg behind me. Today, we're just gonna focus on jigging and see what bites. We're just gonna start casting some shads. I haven't done this fishing in about two years, so to me, there's not too much that's going through my head, except uh, looking for a fishy area and just starting to plug away. It's basically gonna blind luck this one. Let's see if this happens. What we're gonna do, so you can, you can kill the motor. I'll just cast a couple feet. And it counts about 10, so let it get to the bottom. We're kind of shallow here, 30, 32 feet, something like that, 30 to 32. We'll go a little deeper probably in a, in a few. And as soon as it hits bottom, I'm just going to start a steady reel. That's it. i just cover a couple areas. I got one. I got one, baby. I don't know what it is. It's not very big, but I'll take it. <laughs> I've got no clue what I got. It almost feels like an oyster toadfish. Oh, it's a little lake trout. Lake trout. Kind of shallow. Want to come see? He was in about 50 feet, maybe 45. Yeah, yeah it wasn't that deep. Should I kill the now? Yeah. So with these guys, you want to wet your hands. Okay. You see how he's like super crazy? Yeah, they're they're like. Is this what was eaten under the dock? No. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. This is a trout. No. Oh, so, oh wow. This is a lake trout. It's a normal size one. Oh, they get yeah. way bigger than this though. We'll put him back. His spots are pretty. Bye, buddy. See like this big cloudy looking thing on there? That's probably a school of bait. Like if you just see like a, like. Uh, it's just like a blob like shows up okay, that's, what I'm that's okay too that's good usually the fish are around those too oh, okay. but when you see like a single line that's like kind of like off the bottom or just like somewhere in that zone that looks different that's probably a single fish so unlike the sheep's head and the red drum and the speckled trout these fish are just going to keep like kind of swimming around this like certain depth and they're kind of pretty much consistently on the move I oh, missed the hookup. We went, I decided to go a little shallower, like 25 now. I got a good fish on here. That's okay. Yeah, that's what I said. Come shallow. I just got one 25. Oh, I got a big one. He's got a lamprey on him. Oh, it's a brown trout. Big brown trout. And he's got a lamprey. Oh, we're going to do some surgery. Come check this out. You have to come. This is the craziest, craziest thing you're going to ever, ever see. He's got a, that eel on him that I was telling you about. Beautiful brown trout. It's a it's called a lamprey. Oh, he let go. See? Oh my god. See him? What is that? Ew. You see, it's all nasty looking. Yeah. So the <gasps> see the lamprey attached. I want to see if you can see his mouth. Look how crazy his mouth is. Hang on. So that's a brown trout, right? Yeah. Right. Oh, that's very pretty. Look at the eel. See his oh mouth. Gosh. Look at its mouth. It's insane. Oh, I see. He just sucked down on him. That's so cool. Weird. Why do they 
They, they, they see, he latches to the fish and drains his blood like a vampire. I mean, uses his nutrients. We can keep one brown trout for my dad. That's a good size one. Oh my god. So, yeah. That's crazy. So that's a brown trout. I can see him. Yeah. Let's see if we can get that thing out of there. So it's like a leech kind of? It's like a scary, yeah. It's invasive too. It, so this thing we gotta kill it because they're yeah. bad. We don't want these. Just, I have no idea what's the right way to kill them. I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna go savage here. See his mouth? Uh, it's like, this is like oh horror movie God. stuff. <laughs> it's the crap out of me. Oh That's my horror God. movie stuff. Ugh. That's insanity. Ugh. Yeah. What would it do if it like got us? I don't know. Ugh. I'm gonna get that on the YouTube camera. Ugh. You guys see that? How insane that looks? 23 inches. Cool. My biggest is about 31. Yeah, but that's a nice fish. Fat, yeah. yeah. These, that's gonna be what we'll, we'll eat for lunch. Okay. The lampreys are invasive to this part of New York, and I think they're in all the Finger Lakes, maybe most of the Finger Lakes, don't quote me on that. The Great Lakes, um, they're definitely a, a problem. Some years worse. Those things, they'll, they'll attach onto those salmonoids and make them their hosts. It's pretty crazy stuff, man. Nice and steady. Just keep him on there, okay? That hook's in there. Now he, he's gonna run when he gets to the kayak. They go crazy. I'm coming, I'm coming. Is that a lake trout? Yeah, that's okay. Was it the same fish I had or a different one? Uh, got her up around sunrise because uh, I'm supposed to get some thunderstorms. I'm guessing the fish will bite, you know, maybe not sunrise, but early morning's probably better than anything is my guess. So um, I'm just cruising around now looking for a couple fish on my on my little screen. Find bait? I guess there should be some fish on bait. That's crazy, that lamprey though. Well, I killed him back there. Give Meg a trolling plug so she can kind of just troll around. She had a lot of follows, but um, short strikes, couple bites. But uh, we're hitting that midday point, uh, maybe She'll have some more luck trolling. Got him right at the kayak to hit it. Nice brown. Ooh. That's a cute one. Ice brown. He came and like, oh man, he, they've been like messing with me for a few minutes here. He ate a Mackinac, that's a one ouncer. I think I convinced him out of about 45 feet or so. Cool. I don't know if this stuff's making a difference or not, but I'm gonna put it on there anyway. The other one I missed definitely was a nicer fish. That one took some drag on me. Perhaps the endangered white claw. He's got zebra mussels on it. Kind of cool to see zebra mussels growing on a white claw though. Got him. Got one. Something big. I don't know. Doing a little cast and blast. I don't know what I got here. It's pretty, feels pretty nice. Oh, I got Chungus. Oh, 
<laughs> me a pig boy. I don't know. Do I got what this takes? Oh my gosh, he's going crazy on me right now. He doesn't want to come in. It's a big one. Cool. It's a nice one, huh? Oh, check him out. It's a fat brownie. Right, guys, we're gonna keep one more brown trout here. Another 23. All right, check out that butterball here. I think these fish primarily feed on alawives and gobies. Pretty sick girth on them. Three brown trout for me. Missed a couple. Um, had a bunch of falls. Fish were very uh, keep away. -ish. I guess you could say that. Um, beautiful out here. I gotta complete my goal of Meg on the, the slam. The hook sets are tricky, man. I think I, you know, doing the sea mullets and the pompano, jamming the hooks in there, etc. Uh, this is a totally different animal. It's kind of tough to get the, the hook into some of these fish, in my opinion, and keep them pinned, too, so um, not too bad. I think we're just going to pick different locations to fish uh, this whole trip. And I want to just target as many different types of fish as possible, so I guess today I can cross off as a brown trout day. Gosh, all right, that's one more look at that thing. Seems like everywhere you go in the country, there's plenty of invasive species in every waterway. Um, some change the fisheries for, you know, one way, some change it for another. That's that. All right, well, we'll try this again tomorrow. Um, I got metal lures with me. I've got a lot of different things I want to try out and how to jig them. So a little action on the Mackinac shad. And uh, yeah, let's uh, hit the beach and we'll catch up with you guys uh, for the next video. I hope you enjoy that one. It's a change of pace, I get it. Um, but maybe if you liked it, you'll hit that like button, uh, comment and subscribe, all that stuff. So. I'm gonna get Meg on the, the Lakers are gonna be a little easier in my opinion. So that's the next move.